Windows 10 in S mode, is it a benefit, if so how? Or is it a hindrance? Let's find out. My name is Roderick, and welcome to this channel, Seek Right Tech Reviews I will be your host, narrating this video. Seek Right Tech Reviews provides consumers like yourself with tech product knowledge and consumer education on all state-of-the-art tech items that are affordable at budget prices. Everything from headphones and earbuds to Alexa or Echo controlled home entertainment environments, from air fryers to desktop computers. If you are looking for an unbiased examination and review of any tech item, then this is the place for you. If you are new to this channel, sit back and enjoy the video, we'll talk again to you at the end of this video. If you are visiting us again, please, click that subscribe button. Turn on that notification bell. In this video, we will review Windows 10 in S mode operating system. We will share its origin, share why it was designed by Microsoft. Explore its features and functions. Lists its pros and cons. List the step-by-step -step instructions to exit out of Windows 10 S, if it is your choice, understanding the full cost of your choice. Then, I will render my overall rating and review of this operating system. With the Windows 10 operating systems update from Microsoft in April 2018, Microsoft launched its new Windows version, Windows 10 in S mode. The update made Windows 10 in S mode available in Windows 10 Home Edition, Windows 10 Pro, and Windows 10 Pro Education. Now, I've read where Microsoft has often stated the S has no definitive designation, yet Microsoft continually surrounds the S with words like, security, superior performance, speed, and streamlined service. This perpetually sows and plants seeds of thought to all who would give an ear to listen. Each of these words as a seed of thought makes a strong and compelling case for themselves as we'll see further on in this video. What I have learned and gleaned from my extensive research about Microsoft's motivation for Windows 10 and S mode is that their intent is honorable, forthright, sensible, intelligent, and logical. Manufacturers of PCs, laptops, and tablets can mass-produce and release relatively inexpensive technology out to the consumer masses with brand name components included that many consumers recognized, trust, and respect. Windows 10 is one of those brand names. With Windows 10 in S mode, Microsoft can offer a viable alternative with this computer operating system to Google Chrome OS operating system to corporate industry, private sector businesses, and the educational system environments. System administrators, information system managers, and IT technicians can operate, moderate, manage, and maintain their internal network systems easier for the benefits of higher security protocols and safety, faster systems performance, longer system reliability, and greater productivity be it in a classroom or a business network configured work environment. The S-Mode operating system is designed as a, lighter, safe, fast-performing, security-enhanced, restricted, and speed and storage-optimized operating system to work in computers and tablets that don't have a high-end, top-tier processing chip installed. Windows 10 in S mode can come installed on PCs, laptops, and tablets that have an AMD, Intel, or Qualcomm Snapdragon processor chip factory installed. Manufacturers can ship their budget-based computers and laptops out equipped with a processor chip from one of these three processor chip producers and supply relatively decent affordable technology to the masses at a cheaper price point and cost to them. Case in point, here are two Acer manufactured laptops, the Acer Aspire 5 and the Acer Swift 1. The Aspire 5 has the AMD chip installed. The Swift 1 has the Intel Silver chip installed. Both come with Windows 10 in S mode installed. Windows 10 in S mode is constructed to provide the user with these key functions, superior performance, streamlined service, and security. Superior performance by Windows 10 in S mode is faster boot up times for your computer. Faster loads of program software apps. No Windows legacy apps to slow functions down and your computer battery life extended. 
Streamlined performance with Windows 10 in S mode means excessive CPU and RAM use is radically reduced due to all apps factory installed and downloaded from Microsoft Store is tailored to provide quicker loads and functionality throughout the use of the app. Computer storage is optimized by any files needing storage is automatically stored to Microsoft's OneDrive Cloud or Dropbox thus freezing up your local SSD or HDD on your computer, reducing bloatware on your hard drive. Microsoft OneDrive comes with 5GB of storage. Dropbox comes with 2GB of storage with a free account. The strength of Windows 10 in S mode is its inherent security design package. This design package consists of Microsoft's browser, Edge, in safe mode as the default browser. Microsoft Bing as the default search engine, and Windows Defender Security Center as the default antivirus program. Windows Defender Security Center is a uniquely built and succinctly designed antivirus bundle that protects five ways. 1. Virus and threat protection. 2. Device performance and health monitoring. 3. Firewall and network protection. 4. Apps and browser control and 5 family options these three windows features in tandem with each other offer and provides a safe and secure environment for the user whether on and offline surfing and working on the internet as a standalone computer unit or part of a network configured system The pros for Windows 10 in S mode are faster boot up times for the computer. Faster load speeds for programs and apps. Excessive CPU and RAM use radically reduced. Longer battery life and internal computer storage are optimized via Microsoft OND Drive Cloud Access and by adding Dropbox as well. The cons, Windows 10 in S mode only allows apps from the Microsoft Store to be downloaded to the computer. No third-part apps or sites are accessed or installed on the computer. This means while the operating system is in S mode, you cannot download or add any other browser to use, Chrome, Firefox, or Opera. You cannot access any streaming services other than Hulu, Netflix, and Prime Video which are in the Microsoft Store and downloadable for use. You cannot access any third-party websites like PutLocker, Showbox, Vyus, or Watch Series. This is how to check your computer for the version of Windows 10 you have. One. Select the Start button. 2. Click on the Settings icon. 3. Select System. 4. Select About. 5. See which Windows 10 version you're running under Windows specifications. After this process, you realize it's Windows 10 S. Now, don't panic. Now understand, S mode can be disabled. You can exit out of S mode free, no additional cost to you of any kind. Just once you're out, you're out. Support website. Here are the instructions to exit out of Windows 10 in S mode. 1. On your PC running Windows 10 in S mode, open settings, then update and security then activation. 2. In the switch to Windows 10 home or switch to Windows 10 Pro section, select go to the store. If you also see an upgrade your edition of Windows section, be careful not to click the go to the store link that appears there. 3. On the switch out of S mode, or similar page that appears in the Microsoft store, select the get button. After you see a confirmation message on the page, you'll be able to install apps from outside of the Microsoft Store. Now you can add additional browsers. Change your default browser. Download programs of your choosing, and surf websites of your choice. On the flip side, once you have elected to exit out of Windows 10 in S mode, you may experience. Greater battery use will result in less battery life. Slower processing functionality, longer resulting in longer loads from programs and apps internal storage issues larger files and programs eating up ssd and hhd space note i will leave both step-by-step -step instructions for checking your operating system type and exit out windows to s in the description box below my overall rating for the windows 10 in s mode operating system is a b minus one windows defender security center is a competent antivirus program to protect the computer two you can exit out of Windows 10 S if that's your choice to do so. Just remember, it's a one-way street out, you can't go back into S mode. 3. I recommend this mode for school-aged children, 
elementary and secondary, that has to use a computer for remote learning of the schoolwork, do homework, and school projects and need a tech environment to do their work. 4. I recommend this mode for seniors. First-time computer purchase and beginners who want to learn to use computer technology, whose privacy and security of identity and information are paramount. This should always be everyone's first priority online. 5. I recommend this mode for the college student who wants a budget affordable, functional, reliable workhorse computer without the bells and whistles, just focus on passing grades, getting college credits, and graduating. 6. I recommend this mode for sole proprietors, entrepreneurs, startup business owners who are looking for a beginning laptop for business that is mobile, durable, with reliable functionality, and want peace of mind in the reliability of security and safety of both their data and information as well as their prospective clients. If you found this video helpful, informative and provided you with effective, useful product knowledge, please hit that like button. Click the subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell and join the SRT community. I post new videos on Saturdays. Don't forget to check out the description box for the step-by-step -step instructions too. 1. Checking your Windows operating system. 2. How to exit out of Windows in this mode. Please leave a comment, let me know what you thought of the video, and if there is a tech topic you would like to see reviewed, tell us in the comments as well. Appreciate the love. Until the next time, I'm Roderick, your host, and narrator, and this is Seek Right Tech Reviews. We'll see you again soon. Thank you for watching.